We made it back from Island Park. We had so much fun. It was relaxing and nice. I did miss the older kids so much, but we had a good time. And now we're celebrating Casey's birthday. It's actually tomorrow, but he's going to be gone going on a fishing trip. So we're celebrating today. And we're just waiting for him. We just ate dinner. We just got takeout. It's just easier. And now we're waiting oh, yeah, to sing go. happy birthday. Hi. Hi, guys. Hi. Rosie's loving the vlog Hi, guys. right now. <laughs> guys, Too I'm allergic to Rosie. Oh yeah, Lil had a weird allergic reaction to Rosie. You guys want to see my It's never happened dance? before. Her eyes are almost swollen shut. You guys want to guess what? They're, they're normal shut. today. Yeah, they're you guys want to see tomorrow. my break dance? So you have to walk up to it. <laughs> wow, wow. Good moves. I'm like a professional at this point. <laughs> Lila's been going to dance, dance for the past couple me. days to learn a ballroom routine. Ball ball. One, two, cha, cha, cha. One, two, cha, cha, cha. Make sure you stay on your toes, right? Oh, yeah. Let's just stand on your toes. One, two, cha, cha, cha. One, two, cha, cha, cha. Not cha, cha, cha. I love it. And after I do this. One, two, two, cha, cha. I can't wait. I'm so excited to do ballroom. I know, I'm so excited too. And it's too. solo. And Gator just got home from lacrosse camp. A BYU lacrosse camp, how was it? It was so awesome. Cool. It sure were awesome. Was yes. it fun? Yeah, it was, it was super hot though. It was like hundreds, like Jeez. the entire time we were there. So. Well, I feel like I'm hundreds yeah. in and this sweat set. Get, <laughs> some of our oh, I got boop, no, 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 no. And turf is hotter, right? Yeah. Guys, guys, guys. Yeah, I'm happy everyone's back together. It's like hot on my feet. Yeah. So the gang's back together, boys. The gang's back together again. Braylee is upstairs. And I'm the leader. Happy birthday to Braylee. Happy birthday to you. You guys are Oh, sorry, that was a little high. <laughs> yeah! Happy birthday, Dad! You're officially 43. Good Monday morning. We've already been up to quite a few things this morning. Win um, Finn. The amount of times that I call Finn Winston or just Win, I didn't realize when I named Finn Finn that it was going to be so confusing with Winston. I don't know why that those things didn't connect. Even right after we had Finn, people were calling him Finston, and I was like, why didn't I think about that? I just didn't. But it is very confusing, and I do call Finn Winston a lot, but I would probably do that no matter what. Anyway, uh, Finn and I have been outside, and we played in the grass. We've had some breakfast. Finn tried some bananas. I got him a little, like, mesh, chewy thing. I'll show you. Little thing here. And he just chewed on it and he loved it. He did so great. It was messy. Like, so, so messy. We have so much stuff all over us and Ben is messy. So, it's turning the bathtub for him. He's about to get in the bath. Why? Look at this dirty guy. <laughs> did you even eat any banana or didn't you just get it all over your shirt? It looks like it's all over your shirt. Ben is also rolling. He's just like moving and grooving and growing so fast. And it's so fun. <laughs> you do fun. He has the cutest, sweetest <laughs> little personality. I just, I just love you so much. Are you ready for a bath? Yeah. The best thing about not having a baby for a while and then having a baby again is just remembering how fun each stage is. It is bittersweet when your babies grow. It just is. But I think that because this was unexpected, for us to have another baby, it just feels like every single moment is a bonus. Every single thing that we do is a bonus. And how lucky are we? How lucky are we? Hey guys, it has been a minute. I haven't vlogged for a while, have you noticed? We haven't been vlogging. We're just enjoying the last of summer. I got behind on the vlogs. I was doing a brand deal and it took a little bit longer to get approved because it went through different people. Randall's can be a little complicated sometimes. They're fun and I'm always grateful. But, you know, they can have some disruptions in the schedule if you're not careful. Ben? Ben has the, um, am I going to 
Like oh yeah, when Finn cries now he says, mom, 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 and I'm counting it. Uh, we're watching old videos. This is actually Vlogmas from 2017 because we're trying to figure out when Layla started cra crawling. Finn still hates tummy time, we're still working on it. He holds his head up really well, but when I put him on his belly, he will sometimes be okay for a minute, but then he's just like, no thank you get me out of here he was doing tummy time and i was trying to get him to kind of like push up a little bit and he was like no i thought let's watch some old vlogs and see when layla started crawling we haven't found it yet we're in december mama you want the mama i'm trying to get the house cleaned up and i have created a baby that never wants to be put down keep it messy <laughs> keep it messy this guy he doesn't care if the house is messy he's like i don't care mom hold me Hold me. Mm. Also, today is my anniversary. We got some pretty flowers and some yummy chocolates that we've been yum, loving. Yum. I love them. Um, Casey I've is once again on a destination vacation. Just kidding. <laughs> but last year he was in Alaska on our anniversary for our 20 year. And this year he's on his way home from Alaska. It's for work, guys. It, it's his job. Um, <laughs> but I've been thinking a lot about the last 21 years of our marriage. I was thinking about our first anniversary since it's our 21st and how I was a month away from having Braylee. And now this year, Finn is five months, our fifth baby. Who and would have I'm thought? Not seven. Me. <laughs> and my seven year old. Who would have ever thought that we would have five kids? No one. Not me. Truly no one. But thank goodness, because we love this guy, huh? Yeah, he's been so much fun. So Casey's been gone for, I think, 10 days. Has that been 10 days? Yeah, I believe so, about 10 days. That's and, a lot of things. That's and we're excited. Like. We're ready for dad to be home, to get ready for back to school. We just miss him. It, so I, I was thinking about that too, because I have a lot of people in my life when he's gone a lot, or when I talk about it in the vlogs, say like, oh, I could never. I could never be okay with my husband being gone that much. I would not be okay if I had to do things on my own. Oh. And the thing is, is I guess oh. you could if your spouse was like living their dream. Casey's dream was to be in the hunting industry and he worked really hard and he was very fortunate and he works really hard and he has created this incredible business and he's able to live his dream. So yes, you could, like I celebrate these times. It's hard to be apart, but I celebrate that Casey gets to go hunting in Alaska for his job or he gets to go fishing in Alaska for his job, like how incredible. So it is hard and, and there are a lot of things that are said about us and our marriage, but today I'm just celebrating and I can't wait for him to get home because, you know, we've worked really well together and it's been a lot of ups and downs, but it's been such a full, beautiful love story that is not perfect, but I wouldn't take perfect because I am grateful for all the highs and lows and the good days and the bad days and that we have just figured it out together as a couple, as a family, we... I just think that you're stronger from the hard times, happier in the good times, and it's just, it's been a good 21 years. 21 years. Seems wild. We've been together for 24 and a half years. What? But we've been married for 21. How is that wild? So wild. We met in high school. Anyway, I'm just trying to get the house cleaned up. We have... I just had dance. Just had dance. We have Emmy's surprise birthday party we're gonna run to that and for a little bit and then hopefully meet casey when he gets home awesome. i was trying to decide if i should cook something because casey is much more of like a home cooked meal type guy than a like going out to eat but Wait, i just don't think i have time you could go get something and pretend like a salad oh should pretend. i pretend like i cooked it yeah that's a good idea it'll be even <laughs> better he'll be like i made this yeah. do you think i would do you think i'd fool him so. You did cook some pretty good food. Thanks. Thanks, girl. Maybe sleepy boy. A sleepy. A sleepy boy. A sleepy, sleepy, sleepy boy. He Boop. just wants to grab that like I was. <laughs> Are you ready for school? No, it starts on Thursday. The way that that breaks my heart. Summer is over. How did it go by so fast? I know. I was like, hopefully it goes by slow. Yeah, Two the summer flew by. Later. Flew by, and I feel no, bad because seconds. it feels like it was just kind of a womp womp summer. Did you have a good summer? Yeah. We didn't do a whole lot because it's a little hard with a baby. We went so, to, um, well, we are going to go to a few trips. 
Yeah. Like so we ha we have big plans for next year. Yeah. Big plans. Real this guy will big be a little plans. easier. Yeah. He'll be I mean, he'll be a little busier, <laughs> but it's just been a long time since I've had a baby. I'm a little rusty. I've been a little nervous to do things, you know? Yeah, because I like But it has a been baby. a good summer. <laughs> We've so had a lot of family time. So that's good. All right. Well, I'm going to finish cleaning. Get and this place cleaned up. I'm going to eat chocolate. And then Layla's going to steal my chocolates. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, not my old watch is making me so emotional. God, that was six years ago. Um, we just moved into our house. And obviously, Layla was a baby. We were looking at or watching to see when she started crawling. But just all of my kids were so young. And I just missed that time. Oh, time goes by so fast. <laughs> my gosh. And I was just watching me and Braylee. Like, we were in the car together because she couldn't drive. And so I was driving her around. I miss that so much. Thinking about Christmas this year, it's going to be different again because she'll be gone. She'll be living somewhere else. She's moving so soon. And um, this year, this Vlogmas, I wrapped books so that we could open them each night and read them together as a family. And it's just, that's just not going to happen anymore. That's just never going to happen again getting to read books together every night or eat dinner together every night. Oh, so, oh, just trying so hard to always live in the present because I know soon this will be a memory. I was thinking that the other night, Finn and I have been uh, swinging out on our front porch swing. Usually one of the kids will come running out with Layla and she'll like color and color with sidewalk chalk or Yage will come out and talk to me or everyone will come out. It's just been a really special thing this summer. Sitting out there, it was just Finn and me. And I was looking down at Layla's little drawings and I just thought, oh, so soon this is just gonna be a memory too. Life is just so precious and so beautiful. And I know that we all go through hard times, but gosh, just gotta enjoy it and take it all in because it just goes by so freaking fast. Ah, so anyways, I turned the vlogs off because I need to get it together. <laughs> and get some things done. But, whew. Anyway, someone asked me if it's more fun having a baby later in life like this because when you're young, it seems a little more challenging in ways. You care more about the little things. You sweat the small stuff. And I think as you get older, you learn like the small stuff that we used to worry so much about doesn't matter. And yes, absolutely. I think that part of parenting at my age now I don't worry about the little things. I feel like I'm really enjoying things that I didn't allow myself to enjoy with my other kids because I was just too worried about this and that. And I'm, I'm not worried about those things anymore. But the other thing is realizing how fast time goes by and just knowing like I need to enjoy this. I need to enjoy this right now. And so I've really tried to do that. I also really struggled put with postpartum this time. And... And so it was hard for me at first. I'm finally feeling like I'm back to normal and it took a lot longer. So while I, I did feel that way, like I was taking it all in, I was also like, in a way, like ready for the next, the next phase, you know, ready for him to not be a newborn and to kind of interact more. And now that he is <laughs> in this newborn stages, it's just all so hard. It all just messes with you a little bit. I don't do things perfectly, even though it's my fifth time around, I still feel like I was like, gosh dang it, I didn't enjoy it enough. But I did, in a lot of ways too. Like I am enjoying everything. I, I didn't feel guilty to just sit and hold him all day long and not get anything else done. So those are the things that I just feel like I didn't care as much about and I just knew that I needed to be in the moment and be present, so. Mom, be Girl! To party? Heck yeah, you look like a little babe. I love it. Thanks. Are you gonna be hot? No. Okay, I think Finn just fell asleep. I rarely put him on the floor and I read a thing that was like, let your baby roll around on the floor a little bit more. It's good for them. And I was like, yeah, probably. So I'm trying to do that a little bit more without bringing him up. So I'm gonna hurry and change. I'm gonna take advantage of the situation. Oh, <laughs> 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 